I'm sorry, this is about the hundredth video in a row when my hair looks like I've been napping because I've been napping. Hey guys, so today I am doing a standing up video, wild I know. Hello to everyone new here again since my last video, just crazy more people and thank you so much for 15,000 subscribers, that is absolutely mental. So for those of you who are subscribed for my revision A-level GCSE, university even videos, um, this is not one of those, but I hope that it will be entertaining for you, informative because that's what I'm gonna to do today. I'm gonna to be doing some, some digging and some sleuthing, you know? So this is my take on a haul. We're doing it my way today um, because it's not something I normally do. So I kind of want to spice it up from your normal clothing haul. So today I'm going to be talking about a clothing company called Zaffel, which you may have heard of because I feel like it's quite well known amongst like my kind of age group. So to disclaim, this stuff was sent to me. I did not purchase this. However, I turned down the sponsorship for this video because although I am a student, <laughs> I decided it would be like taking away from the value of the video if I was sponsored to do this. I will still speak as if I had bought them and is it worth your money and my money. Um, I just didn't feel like doing a sponsored video would be correct. Pretty much honestly, I'm just gonna try most of them on and tell you what I think of them. Obviously your opinions on the website itself and like the ethics of it, the prices, the sizing issues that you might have with it, which I will touch upon a little bit, that's all up to you. That's not what I want this particular video to be about. Don't think I'm skirting around the issues like I'm sure at some point in the future I will talk about my stance on certain things like that. But this particular video, at this time of year when I feel like you might be wanting to go and buy some summer clothes, all I'm doing is giving you a bit of a like, this is physically what it looks like, how it feels, what I think, would I spend my money on it, should you spend your money on it. So if you haven't subscribed already, sorry for the long intro, please go ahead and subscribe and give us a thumbs up if you are enjoying it. So basically for reference, I am a size 8, I tend to always get an 8, um, however I do have not tiny boobs. Um, they're quite like they're definitely bigger than average so some of these things I bought knowing that I was buying for my top half not that this is going to be like a website review but like just for reference it was all perfectly okay it came so much quicker than I thought it was going to come this is the bag that everything comes in so it comes in its own little not very environmentally friendly zip locked bag but it's a really nice bag a lot of plastic or like whatever this material is but you could probably reuse these bags for things because they are durable so I will be using them probably to like I don't know put like socks in and stuff so that I can store my socks in my and like tights in one and like that kind of thing um, and I can use them to organize my stuff next year uh, in my cupboard so I will be reusing my plastic bags don't know about you 12 pounds 71 is this first item so this is the item here this is gonna make my light go like wild I'm telling you now but this is the item here it is this frilly front tied blouse okay so in general i love this one i think it's so cute it does look pretty much exactly the same as the image on the picture the only thing i have to say about this one actually two things um it gapes kind of funny here i don't know if that's me and like my sizing it's kind of tight here which i knew it would be and like gapes there so you have to like pull it down so i would never normally wear this with a nude bra this one it's silly to like pretend that you're trying to hide it um, so I would wear something that's more just like, eh, it doesn't matter if you see it because it's supposed to be there. The quality is actually really nice, it's kind of silky. So this is the next one, it is a long sleeved kind of jumpery feel top that is cropped and tied. This is not my angle, the camera's like facing really weirdly down but there you go, that's what it looks like. I really like the colour of this, I really like the style of this, the fit of this. I honestly think it's really nice, um, it's a little bit... It's like very soft feeling to the point where it feels like a little bit cheap, if you know that kind of feeling that's like that little bit too soft that you're like, what are you made of? If you have been following me on 21 Buttons, you would have seen me post a couple of pictures in this and also on Instagram. Go follow me if you haven't, at online new on both of those. And if you ever wanna shop something I'm wearing on 21 Buttons, I get a tiny bit of commission from it. So that's always good. If you haven't signed up and you use my code, link thingy in the description, then I also get some commission from it. Why not, you know, why not? 
help a gal out. Uh, but even if you just want to see stuff and get a direct link to it by following me on 21 Buttons, you can get a link. This one is 13.48. This next one is a t-shirt that was 11.94. This is the wrong colour. Um, I wanted the khaki green one and they did not have it so the lady who I was talking to said, sorry, do you want the pink one instead? And I was like, okay, I mean no, but like, okay, I want to see what this looks like. And it's just this like tie front t-shirt like what I mean like really what is there to say about this it's nice like it's absolutely fine quality I mean it's just as see-through as you would get in like H&M um or anything like that and if you've seen that tweet about H&M and they're like stupid sizing then like I like this and I think it's a nice top I don't love the color personally kind of looks better now I'm a bit more tan okay, so this next one I really don't like and like I probably won't show that much of it because the color is beautiful the material is actually really nice. It's like a really nice crepe material. Um, crepe? You know what I mean. Um, it was 11 94 but like honestly, Bjorn said I look like a, like a Bavarian barmaid in this because it's like really very booby and very small. Like it is basically a bra with sleeves um, and the sleeves are really short. So I just, it looks really weird. Like I will briefly show you, wow. And then it just ends there. It's just a no from me. Like if I was gonna do a really clickbaity thumbnail, which I'm kind of considering, then maybe I would use this in it. Maybe I'll take a picture, but like, wow. Like, wow. Okay, so this is the final top I have to try on. Okay, I've just done what I think it should look like, but it like probably shouldn't look like this. Okay, so this is this top. It, I mean, it, you know what I mean. It's supposed to be like that, I think. And like crisscross at the back, like it is really cute, I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't feel tight, but it feels tighter than all the other ones, so maybe I did get a smaller size. Um, but I really like it. It's like really nice. The material, again, is like nothing offensive at all. Um, and let me check the price on this one. And this was also 11 94 Okay, I lied, that wasn't the last top, this is. Look how cute it is, it's got a tea bag, and it says t-shirt, and I like t-shirts and tea. Um, and it's just like a top, like it is honestly just like, a t-shirt you know and I like it and it's really nice quality it feels so good um, I would definitely wear this to like rehearsal or whatever and like woo you know it's fun it's on backwards so just ignore that we'll pull this up but the next item is this fishnet top this is how I would wear it I would wear it with like a t-shirt over the top so I thought I would just show you not this t-shirt but like just for the example and it also came with these <laughs> which I would wear and then like have my jeans at the top maybe I think they're cool I've not tried these bad boys on yet but like this is cool I like this again kind of short on the arms like I kind of have monkey arms but not that much you know like they're not that bad um this is cute, I think this is really cool. New thinking she's cool and 16 again for two minutes straight. So the next item is in my favorite color, which is light blue. And this is a dress. This was 14 pounds 64. And it's basically this tie front button down little mini dress. I'm still wearing my jeans, but I'll show you anyway. So the thing about this dress is it's kind of like poolside cute, not going out cute. And I kind of wanted it to be like, I could just wear this out and about. And I feel like it just doesn't look nice enough to do that. This is like expectations versus reality. Like, oh my God, such a pretty bow. My God, what is that? Cause like, I can't tie this like that. I don't know, you could probably tie it better than me and then it would look better, but. Okay, so the next thing are a pair of trousers that actually came in a set. So I just want to find the price for you. Um, but I can't understand the top. It's supposed to look like this like cute little crisscross number and I did it once and now I cannot get it back in its formation so like just imagine it on me you know so these are the trousers I'll show you now I love these these are one of my favorite things in the video oh all the rubbish everywhere um they're just these really cute little ba bam trousers the like seaming is not amazing you might be able to see there like <laughs> It's not great for the price. I think they're really nice. They're a bit see-through. You might have been able to see. They are fine if you wear the right one underwear with them. Like, they're not a problem. 17 34 so pretty decent. The next thing was a bikini set that was 12 pounds, but the top did not fit me. Basically, I have very, like, quite small, at least, shoulders, like, all the way around. So 
I often have to like get a bigger size to like actually fit the boob area but then have to really tighten the strap so they fit and then they end up squashing it and you end up with quadruple boob it's not a good look so I decided to not put that on um or even wear it and I gave it away to someone else who it would fit better so um I don't have the top but here are the bottoms they are a really nice quality literally as good a quality as like like I said H&M or something like that like they're nice obviously i've not tried these on in water they could like shrink or do something crazy this is a khaki green one but it's padded um it's a really nice color like i really really like this i'm going to try this on quickly for you so you can just see what the top looks like i won't try the bottoms on but these are the bottoms they're again like see i've tried them on already they're like the same as the other ones so this one is kind of like a little like sports bra crop top kind of style the panning is a little bit awkward like it's a bit really like stiff and quite small so I feel like it kind of looks a bit weird. Other than that I think it's really nice and I really like the colour. And then finally I got this one, sorry that green one was 12.71 and this one I'm about to show you is really cute. I think this is like one of my favourites of the haul um, and this is 12.33. This is this swimsuit with a big old cutout. Okay so I just took my thumbnail and my favourite top and I thought I'd put it back on obviously for the thumbnail so the end of the video logic anyway i wanted to summarize everything for you i hope you enjoyed seeing all of that here are my thoughts basically there is a real mix on this website i feel like unfortunately you kind of have to try to see you can send stuff back i think they have a good returns policy um i think the sizing you just have to look at the reviews the reviews really helped me there was a lot of stuff that i saw in reviews that i did not like the look of um in the pictures that people put or what they said so i didn't get them and a lot of things that i got having read the reviews and they matched up to what people said and the photos were really useful so i think their review section is very good and if you wanted to go on and have a look at any of the things that i bought all the links are in the description but overall the quality is not perfect but i feel like the quality really isn't that much worse than a lot of these other affordable brands like even like h&m and stuff like high street stores it's very comparable quality and pretty similar prices as well um it's just there's a lot of variety so if you feel like checking it out and you enjoyed the stuff and you enjoyed anything that I was wearing or the kind of things I was wearing it's all on there go have a look go have a browse see if you like anything overall I would recommend at least having a look even if you don't end up buying something have a browse um and see if there's anything that takes your fancy and if you were going to spend some money on there don't go crazy but like you could try a few things out I wouldn't see the harm in doing that I would do that I would spend some of my own money to try some stuff out so if you want to see any of these bad boys in action they will be on my 21 buttons account of course um, and you can go and click through and buy them from there. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed filming it for you and I will see you in a video very soon. Thank you for watching guys and see you soon. Bye!